Once upon a time, there was a prodigy, prodigy, a boy who set the Jewish world above. From a family steeped in virtue and tradition, faithful students of religion, men of knowledge, and men of learning, kept the Torah fire burning. Yet the experts did proclaim he would put them all to shame. His name was Monish. Shining stars seek his praise. From near and far. Monish. Shining stars. Sing his praise from near and far. Let's take it up. Monish was a fine young lad, and such a clever mind, that youngster had it. He'd explain away with ease, the hardest passages in Maimonides. And good looking, what a sight, wavy hair as black as night. Brows that arched with deep desire, eyes that pierced you with their fire. His name was Monish. Shining stars sing his praise from near and far. Monish, shining star sing his praise from near and far. Now let's hear what the young women of the village thought of the hero. Resolute, his face aglow, body swaying to and fro, all the girls would swoon and blush when he passed them in a rush. And every day he'd go to lessons. But the rabbi's little white maid was the one he was in present. While on the stove, her milk was burning. She didn't know it. She was watching Monish learning. Pretty seamstress, who lives next door, accidentally drops her needle to the floor. When his voice she overhears, and her eyes fill up with tears. In her heart she feels a sob, fights to hold inside a throng. I didn't recognize you guys. <laughs> but good as gold, our noble lad, not a clue the youngster had. All this female adoration leads us not into temptation, much to Satan's great frustration. He craves an old Talmudic song, taken from the dusty annals of Mosaic law. Oh, the ox who gores the neighbor's cow. That's his chief concern for now. Oh, the ox who gores the cow. That's the kind of thing he holds most dear. And if you're listening, Satan, stick it in your 